triple G's and I'm going to make pickle onion. So I'm going to turn the camera around and start. So what I'm going to do, I, I already washed my onions, already washed them. And what I do, this is what I use for my pickle onion. I use dried, dried chilies. And this one is this this one here, this one here, and then the I also use the little ones because we like it our we like our pickle onion hot, and this one is this one. And I also use uh, Himalayan salt. And apple cider. And I got two bottles. I'm just gonna make a little, I'm gonna make a bottle for my son and one a little one for me. So he be coming this weekend, so I have it set until he can take it home and to eat it. So I'm gonna I'm gonna cut I'm gonna cut these. So I'm just going to leave it like that. You can cut it in another half if you want. But like that if you want. I'm going to do that because I'm making two of them. And this onion is very strong. It's already making my eyes water. So now I'm going to stuff it in the bottle. And this is what I do. My pickle onion. Let me put them in there. Because like I said, we like I was hot. And then you put in the onion. And then I always do the little ones. Sometimes I use the crushed chilies. And you can start putting salt if you want. My eyes is running because it's the onions is very strong and then you put more onion in there make sure you stuff that stuff it down stuff it in there And then, and then you add some more chili. And then maybe a few more can go in there. You gotta make sure it's all in there. And you can't eat it right away. You have to let it sit for a while. Um, I usually let it sit for a week. And then you just add your ap apple cider. And I'm going ahead and use regular salt. This is better salt but you can also use regular salt. It doesn't matter. You're gonna shake it. You cover it. Make sure it's covered, and then give it a little shaking. I'm just gonna make me a little bottle that I'm. And like I said, I usually let it sit for a week. When it's ready, add some more here. Make sure it's all really to the top and you can also make it 
without the chilies if you don't want it hot but we like it hot so, so. and I leave it on my counter and you just shake it all that chili all shaking around like I said you can put also put um, crushed chilies as well So that one's done. So then I'm gonna make mine. Um, I like mine hot as well. So I'm gonna just put the chilies in there. Put it onions in there. I'm just gonna make a little for me. Not much because I always can make it. Let's put the chilies in there. Salt and then cider. Yeah, this one just is going to be for me, so it's okay. And then you do the shaking as well. You can use uh, uh, the white one as well, but I like I prefer the apple cider. And make sure you get all it all the apple cider covering the onions. So that way it can be pickled. And I'm um, like I said, I'm just doing little a uh, little one for me. Get that on there. Let's see if it's let's add a little more. And after I get this in there. it's in there um this is what i do i'm going to rinse the covers excuse me i'm going to rinse the covers and i'm gonna i'm gonna wipe it just get it dried because I'm gonna I put wax paper over it. Let's make sure. The reason why I put in wax paper over it, so the apple cider don't eat and make it rusty. The the lids. And then Make sure it's in there tight. So there's one. There's one pickle onion. That's one. That one is for me. I just made me a little bit. And this is for my son. He'll be taking it home with him. Make sure it's there. Okay. Yeah, you like to use wax paper on the lids, so. Um, the lids don't get um, rusted by the apple cider because it will rust. And this one is for my son. Oops, that's for my son. Pickle onion. See? So. I hope you enjoyed my little pickle, how to make pickle onion video. I might make a little mug bang with my pickle onion when it's done. And it's really pickled. And like I said, you don't have to make yours hot. Um, you can just put the, pick, the onion, salt, 
and apple, apple cider and you can use um, the the crushed chilies the you know the dried crushed chilies or you can use the um, whole chilies dried chilies and once in a while I do use the crushed chilies but I had these in hand so I use those like I said, you don't have to make it hot. You don't have to add no chilies in, in there. But like I said, we like it hot. And I give it a week. And my son be coming this weekend. And he can take his home. And it should be ready by, uh, by Monday. I usually give it a week to settle. And let all the nice, juicy ingredients settle into that onion. Yes. So until the next one, you guys all take care. And peace out.